So weekly, I talk about the single family housing market, but I also have a lot of clients that are purchasing and selling condos and multifamily. So we will get to single family, but right now I want to start with condominiums. Okay. Because we don't often talk about condos. Um, but I'm noticing some changes in all of those markets. Okay. Let's start talking about condos. With condos, currently we've got 274 active on the market and 487 pending. So it's still a very impressive time to be selling condos. But the good news is that inventory is up. Inventory is up. I remember when the inventory was around 150. 200 units on market. And now we have exponentially more. And that's going to continue to grow, I believe. As the inventory continues to grow, it's going to be easier and easier for buyers to purchase. So, um, but what I want to look at though, is the days on market. And this has caused panic for anybody selling, but I don't want you to panic. You got to play your cards right to make the most amount of money. Okay. So the days on market have jumped from 11 days on market previously to 34. Don't stress the days on market. Just understand you got to price your home appropriately, your condo appropriately. Don't overprice it. And the days on market, it's just going to happen. You're going to sell as long as you're marketed and priced appropriately. But keep in mind and be prepared. It might not sell in the first five or six days. They're pending in 34 days on average right now. All right, let's jump over to multifamily housing. Active units on market is up. We're at 293 active units on market. That again is also near double of where it was at the lull. So the lull was last year, March, April, May, right? And there were less than half from what I remember of what there are now. So there's nearly 300 active units on the market, meaning buyers have more to look at. Multifamily homes now are three times more days on market than they were here in Rhode Island even last month. That's a big difference. Three times more days on market than last month. I mean, we went from 15 days on market until stuff was pending. And by the way, check this out. At $96 per square foot median, and right now we're at 47 days on market, with $92 per square foot. All right, let's jump into single family, right? The days on market are more than double of what they were. That's right. They used to be pending single family homes a month back were pending 15 days on market. And it just jumped over to 36 days median time frame on market. It's more than double, which is crazy, right? In addition to that, though, the good news is that prices are still looking to appreciate a tad, right? They're still appreciating. We don't see a decline in pricing, but you know, we do see a huge uptick in um, in competition, right? We're now up to about 1,250 single family homes on the market, which is more than twice as many as we had last year at this time. It's a lot of houses now, a lot of houses, still not enough.